Its annual lecture series by the Center for Values and Leadership, a brainchild of Professor Patutomi. The focus of this year's symposium is leadership and the challenge of ultra-poverty, the aim of transforming the poorest of the poor. And the speakers start debating the real challenges and the situation confronting the continent. When I looked at the statistics, I was startled. I was startled about the statistics about, of poverty, particularly that affecting children in Nigeria. Let me list some of these statistics, and let's each think about what these statistics mean. 60% of Nigeria's population lives at or below the poverty line of less than 250 Naira a day. A close look at the shape of the map of Africa. We show that the maker, in his infinite wisdom, destined this continent to be his gun. The gun that would destroy the shackles that hold back humanity's quest for optimization and the establishment of a world of peace and goodwill to all creation. Now, if Africa is God's gun, then West Africa is God's trigger. And this shows the enormous responsibility on us in West Africa to get it right. Ghana and Nigeria in particular have to know that we owe a duty to the rest of West Africa and the entire continent to leave no stone unturned in our quest to set in motion the sociocultural and economic transformation of Africa. Two of the speakers here are politicians, although they belong to different political parties. But on the subject matter, they seem to agree on ways the nation should go in transforming the poorest of the poor. Education for me is key. Uh, we're not going to fight poverty if we don't address education. And when I say education, I'm talking about fit for purpose education. Uh, a situation where we continue to have, you know, each time you, you, you get the old level results across the country, then, and you see the number of people that don't pass, what you're seeing is poverty. What you're seeing is a completely warped value system. Poverty is bad. I don't think there's any debate about it. But what is worse, and which we suffer from more than the general problem of poverty around the continent and the world, is inequality. Thought-provoking speeches expected to drive Nigerian leaders to action in tackling the challenge confronting the group of Nigerians at the bottom of the social strata.